Hello guys and welcome to Careless Coders. So this video is about some of the most common errors that I have found and are very irritating and frequent in Flutter. So this is a very common and simple mistake that I almost always do and that is that you if you have defined a decoration box for your container then you you must declare the color component inside it and not outside it so just to not remember the color component must be de defined inside the decoration box and not outside unless the decoration box is not defined and and is default so let's move on to the next error now vertical viewport was given unbounded width so this error in this case is caused by a list view when it is placed inside a column or a row list view takes all the vertical space available to it unless it is constrained by its parent widget but since a column or a row doesn't impose any so in this case the list view is getting an infinite width or in the case of a column it will get an infinite height so in this case we just remove the row and put all of the elements inside the list view and if you absolutely must need to do this layout then you can also put your list view in an expanded widget This is an error that almost all of the developers often encounter and we just directly go to Stack Overflow and search for the solutions. And this is the keyboard overflow error. So whenever we uh, click on a text field and the keyboard appears, so by default what the app does is that it first it tries to reduce some of the size of the elements of the, on the screen. If it is unable to reduce the size enough to show the keyboard properly uh, because of constraint sizes, it shows an overflow error. To solve this, one possible solution can be single child scroll view. With single child scroll view, Flutter automatically scrolls screen up just enough when the keyboard is used. So this one is actually a very good concept that you should understand. Uh, there is an overflow error and why it is happening is that there is a column that is wrapped inside a row and which has unbounded parameters because of that the column doesn't know how far width it has to stretch so if this is the layout that we have to follow then what we can do is wrap our column in an expanded widget this expanded widget will automatically fill up the space that is available and its children column will use that space accordingly instead of doing this you can also use a flexible widget instead of an expanded and use a flex factor to the last and most irritating error of this video is the incorrect parent data widget to make it go away you just need to understand a few things an expanded or a flexible widget should be wrapped inside a row a column or a flex and a positioned widget must be wrapped inside a stack widget. Correcting that, our error is solved. So that's all for today guys. Tell us some of the errors that you find to be very common and irritating in the comments. And if you have not already subscribed, then please subscribe to the channel. We are close to reaching a thousand. Thank you.